All right, hello everyone, it's Team Rocket Dross here with the new survival series on the channel. And as you guys can tell by the title, we're gonna be playing in a, a zombie apocalypse. What was that? And as you guys can see, we got some other mobs right here around us. And uh, yeah, so this is a new mod that I came across, guys. It has like, I think like 35 or something like that mods. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited, guys. The whole point of the game is just surviving. Um, so they kind of took out some of the other mobs like spiders, skeletons, witches, and all that. So now it's just a bunch of zombies and then just other uh, mobs as you guys can see here. And uh, this is actually the second try of... Whoa, I don't know what that was. Uh, but I did spawn an extra chest or a starter chest. I forgot what it was called and you guys are gonna call me cheaters guys But trust me, they're gonna come in handy and uh, I do got shaders on so we'll see how this works out guys right now. It's working I actually uh, Already started this uh, <laughs> Let's play I guess or this playthrough, uh, but I was having a lot of issues with lag and stuff like that um, so I ended up uh, restarting it and I did end up dying. I didn't like really play it It was just more like testing all the settings make sure that everything was gonna work properly and then um, I, I realized that you could re it's really easy to die in here. So <laughs> we'll see how that works out guys and uh, to start off with I guess we do have some tools So let me just get everything ready. Um, I kind of have like a certain way that I like stuff uh, so let's just start by crafting a crafting table and then we're gonna craft ourselves actually let's use this wood because i don't really like acacia wood and then we're actually gonna make ourselves an axe so we'll you know go through some of the mobs that we're actually or mods that we're actually able to get in just a little bit guys but first i want to get my basic tools ready because yeah they're gonna we're gonna need them um so let me just get some of our basic tools ready and uh so we do have some food and uh, i guess we could get started so um to be honest i don't really know too much about this uh, mod other than the basics uh something that i am gonna be doing guys as we progress is that i'm uh, physically gonna go into the settings and change the speed of the zombies depending how far we are along and uh you know just to uh make it a little bit more interesting i guess as we're going and um what are those are those well sharks Oh, they're trying to eat the crab. Will they attack us? Oh, there's eels. Oh. Look at that. They're fighting. Who's going to win? Oh, he spawned another one? Or is he like... Oh, he's in the water, I think. Yeah, he's down there. Oh, it's a... Oh, he killed one. It's a whole war going on. Uh, and these guys are eels. Um, they seem to be... Oh, they do hurt me. Alright, so that's good to know. I guess we really can go in the water. And, um, yeah, so it's really interesting, guys. Uh, we got a bunch of different trees, different mobs, like I mentioned. Um, I learned the hard way not to attack sheep. So, if you guys are playing this game, don't attack sheep because then they all run after you and try to kill you. And I died by sheep. And uh, it doesn't seem like there's no other mobs around here. So, oh, there we go. That was quick. Um, so, now we know not to go in the water because there's a bunch of eels. It seems like they can still see me even though I'm not in the water. Uh, they're actually able to follow me. And, uh, yeah, that kind of scared me. But I guess it was just that. Um, and it seems like we are in a small, like, at the edge of the water. What are these? Are these badgers? I believe these, these will attack us. Oh. Yeah, so I need to be careful, guys, because we... <laughs> yeah, I, I drew blood. And uh, that's actually a bad thing, because zombies could actually smell that. Or they could uh, sense it. I don't know the way that mod works. Uh, but, yeah, they're able to actually see that. And then they... Uh, that kind of gets their attention and another thing is that the actual zombies don't die due to a uh, sunlight so these will just you know just normal it's kind of like uh the walking dead where they're just walking around and then when one sees you or or stuff like that then they start gathering slowly um so there is also a mod called uh the blood moon and uh, what this mod does guys is that you're not able to it's like random i believe um 
you're not able to sleep when it comes out and the game actually alerts you and when that happens you get a horde of just zombies just coming after you and when i mean a horde guys i mean a horde like a bunch of them so yeah i'm not really too fond of that and another one it was the first night so i'm not looking forward to that um so i guess before you know we do anything let's actually uh take some of these trees down and maybe we could actually start our base here or at least close to here but i just want to be ready before we continue timber bam so that's actually really cool oh what was that what are these uh spruce cone so i don't know what that's gonna be about um but we didn't get no saplings to replant it right i wonder if this is what that is oh it is okay so let's just plant a few here and there that we at least we can have uh, some more trees right um what is that is that a jellyfish okay so it seems like we're at the edge of the water and i feel like that's a swamp over there but to be honest since we do have bombs of plenty i'm not sure what other uh mods there is uh but in order to survive the first night guys um i don't know what i want to do should we go exploring or should we start building uh some sort of like base around here in order to survive the first night and uh it seems like okay we got a, a desert on the other side um that's a shark that's a shark if i ever seen one um so i need to be careful with these because these are the ones that hurt me and uh, we haven't seen any zombies around us uh they're also attracted to any sound so if we knock down i imagine any trees or we start building and stuff like that then this is gonna attract them um but since we are at the edge right here i don't think we're gonna see any um so to start off with guys i kind of want to just you know make like a little hole on the ground and maybe we could just see what happens because if we do get the blood moon in the first night um it's gonna be really really bad and uh, there's no way i'll be able to survive that uh low me there so i don't know what that's about um and i need to hurry up guys because it's daylight it's it's going by fast um so like that and then let's just uh i think i have a a light source with us and they're also attracted to light so yeah having lights around us are not a good thing because they could actually see that um and i don't see any zombies just yet so let's just maybe do that and we're still really close to spawn we spawned over there so if we do die um then we'll be able to get back here and then um so something that i wanted to do was make um maybe some okay we can we got some spruce trap doors and in order to and the reason that i want to do these is just for that although actually i don't i don't like that guys i don't like that i need to do it the opposite way all right oh man the the wooden axe is really really bad all right so let's actually do them this way okay there we go or actually that's not the way i want to do it but uh i just want to do that just in case i get scared or whatever or they start following us so we'll see if the first night uh there's gonna be a a blood mood hopefully not though all right so it seems like we're fine i think by now it would have alerted us that it would have been a blood moon oh no we got hyenas or something i don't know if you guys were able to hear that Um, I don't know what that was. I can't, I can't see behind us. Oh, that's not the block I wanted to break. Oh, they're coming. So I'm guessing they're seeing the light. So what if we break it? Okay, guys, they still see us. Oh, man. So it's going to be kind of tough trying to get away from them. Um, I think the actual light, or I don't know what did it, but, uh, yeah, we got visitors now. And, uh, they actually hit pretty hard, guys. I just got hit by one of them, and it did four hearts, so. Oh, 
I'm dead. That's it, guys. I'm out. Oh no! Help! Look at Um, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do any damage to these guys. I should have built a bigger hole. And uh, another thing that they're actually able to do is that they're actually able to break locks. So hopefully that's not what they're doing. Alright, so I'm just gonna begin hitting these guys because, uh, I mean, why not, right? It's really loud. I even uh, lowered the audio. Let's actually see if we can do that a little bit more. Because uh, they're actually really, really loud. Alright, that's a little bit better. We did get an advancement. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know how much we're actually going to be doing. Oh, look at that. We just got this member. It got chopped up. Since, uh, I mean, we really can't do anything. Might as well get some stone and uh, start crafting up some stuff, right? In case we do come across any more uh whatever mob the other one was that we killed um it seemed like it what was it uh raw pheasant i guess it's a pheasant good thing there's not a pokemon um but if we do come across any more i am just gonna take them out and uh hopefully it doesn't attract any zombies oh what is that all right so i'm not gonna be able to mine that um so once i make a stone axe then we'll see if uh we're gonna be able to do these um, but it seems like these guys are still after me, like... It's still... I don't know, I guess they know I'm in here? Because I could still hear them, like, walking, or I don't know, they're trying to break the block, or... Or what it is that they're doing. But, uh, since we're down here, guys, I might as well, uh, let's see, uh, some of the stuff that the actual uh, mod has. So, we got page one. Um, so these are just gonna be your normal Minecraft items, right? Yeah, so these are normal. So then we start off, I imagine, with this one right here. So, yeah, we got a bunch of other ones. Uh, yeah, I guess it starts, like, around here. So we got brown bears, black bears, deer, feral wolves, coyotes, foxes, tarantulas. I don't even know what that animal is. We got a goat, jellyfish. Okay, so there's a bunch of mobs. Um, so we're also going to get a bunch of different hide, obviously. Uh, a cape, huh? Guess we're gonna be able to get some capes and some wolf heads. Man, this looks kind of scary. Some boars. Um, a wand. Okay. So, a different type of actual. Okay, so I. Oh, yeah, Biome So Plenty. I guess that's the mod. Let's see these right here. This is the Better Animals Plus mod. You guys could actually see it in the bottom. Um,. Like right here it says palm wood planks. In the bottom of it, it says biomes of planting. So that's how I'm able to know where the actual item, what mod it belongs to. Uh, so I guess uh, this one's actually pretty big. So there's going to be a lot of items. Uh, juggernaut helmet. So these are actually going to come in handy. And uh, so there's a lot of stuff right here that we're going to use, I believe. Yep. We got some ammo, some guns that we actually are able to get. Uh, so let's just, uh, what is this? Um, are we able to see, like, the whole gun? Uh, how do we see how to craft these? Maybe we have to unlock these, right? I don't think we could, uh, go ahead and just get it. So we got some ammo. And, uh, so we got a lot of weapons. That's basically gonna be a must, uh, for this mod right here. And, uh, ooh, hanging body, held body, so I guess that's more decoration, and it's a modern warfare as well. Okay, I don't know why these are empty or blank. Uh, yeah, these are just, like, your average stuff. Uh, we got arrow stability. Oh, they add haste. This is from the Quark mod, and I'm not too familiar with mods, to be honest. So a lot of these things are just, I'm just going to be a complete noob. So if you guys uh, know some of these items or some of these mods, then I welcome any help. So this is actually something that uh, we're actually going to try to get uh, really quick. Um, crude wooden shield. So in order to get this, uh, we actually need stick and some planks. So that's going to be one of the first items that we're going to aim for 
and uh, ooh, a bunch of these other weapons and arrows wow there's actually quite a bit of uh different stuff guys compact raw pork chop so there's actually quite a bit so hopefully the night and soon and then uh, yeah we could continue all right so we got some uh cooking up some raw pheasant and uh so we are playing in 1.12 guys uh and uh so i'm not sure exactly like you know the way that 1.12 was uh since uh yeah they changed a lot over the years uh so we'll see i don't know if that's wayne there there's just so many up there that yeah there's just uh they're gathering up so let's actually make a a stone pickaxe and then we'll see if we could actually mine some of these and it seems like we can't i don't even know what these blocks are guys uh but since we are here might as well start uh using all these other uh, our old uh, wooden um, tools in order to actually cook up some of our food and uh, since we're actually going to be able to craft some uh, stolen ones there we go and it is raw salmon so might as well cook these right here and I believe each one only does one, so we're gonna have just enough in order to do this. And uh, by no means, guy, am I, guys, am I a professional Minecrafter? So there's actually gonna be a lot of mistakes that I make. So yeah. All right. So I made a couple swords just in case, you know, we do break one. Uh, we're actually gonna have enough. And um, I don't know what time it is. I don't know if it's day or nighttime, guys. Uh, but I mean, doesn't hurt to check. And then. Uh, we could actually run for it right uh so might as well start making a tunnel and uh hopefully you know um they still think i'm right there and uh, they won't like listen or follow me or anything like that um i need to see that this doesn't actually go to the outside uh because yeah that, that wouldn't be a good thing i just want to see if it's daytime already out you know is that too much to ask for Okay, it is daytime, guys. Let's run for it. Oh! Oh, no, there's sharks. Guys, I'm dead. Look how many there is. Man, the sharks were just like... Man, like, they don't even wait for me to get in the water. Like, they must be so hungry that they just like... Oh! Okay, and these guys are still chasing me. They can still see me. Um, oh, there's a brown... A black bear... Um, I don't know how hostile they are. I don't know if we have to hit them in order for them to uh, chase after us. But, um, oh, you guys saw how many zombies there was. Uh, so it's going to be really hard to actually go in the water now just because, uh, oh, I don't know what that was. All right. So I think we lost the other guys. I think they're on the other side of the hill or uh, they're not rendering. But, um, yeah, guys, I think we're going to have to explore somewhere else um, and start you know right away building like some sort of bunker in order to hold off because uh yeah this doesn't seem like a a really good place having so much water around us and not being able to actually go in the water um something that i would like are they coming no all right so we got a straggler right there and um man we have to go back so i wonder if they despawn let's actually check so we do have a okay i just want to check guys and i shouldn't be running because oh actually i need to be eating so we can start healing and it seems like they did it despawn so that's a good thing and uh here's a, a pheasant so hopefully the black bear is like not trying to eat it or something trying to take it away from us and uh the mod actually the fps have seen um seems to be actually uh holding up so that's a good thing i did want to play shaders because um it completely changes the game uh using shaders it just uh, makes it you know just work it makes it a little bit more misty and uh just overall uh makes makes it a better game and okay the black bear is not chasing us and uh, hopefully it's not like uh, the sheep where like you attack one and then they all attack you. What is this? Oh, that's a cave. All right, so I just want to explore around and see if we can find anything. Oh, did those guys see me?
Oh, those are wolves. Guys. I'm playing it normal. I'm not even playing hard. I was getting it put hard, but I don't know if I want to do that now. Um, this is like if zombies weren't enough to worry about. Now we got these. Uh, okay, so. Uh, wait, are they getting attacked? Seems like there's some meals down there. Or I don't know what kind of mob that is. Uh, what happened to the other one? Let's Okay, they're down there. Um, I don't think they're gonna be able to get up here. Should I just slowly start heading down there and see if I could uh hit them? Oh, I'm so scared. Oh I don't know how high they could actually What? Oh I get is he hitting me? I think he was actually hitting me. Yeah. So they're actually able to reach like two blocks. And they actually see me really far away as well. Alright, so I guess we're not we're not messing with those guys. And uh we're just gonna head off this way. And uh, hopefully they lose sight of me. And uh yeah, they don't follow me, so guys, we're literally like just food to these guys right we got zombies we got wolves um i don't know if the coyotes are actually gonna attack us because i think they're a little bit smaller uh so i don't think they're as uh vicious as uh, wolves right um it seems like those were feral wolves not the actual regular wolf i believe there's two different types of wolves here so for sure we need our axe and i think i hear a zombie around here Oh, what type of bear is that? Sound looks like a polar bear. Is it nighttime already? Like, how fast are the is the game? Yeah, it's gonna begin to be nighttime, so I might just uh, pile up. Oh no, man! I need to be careful with those. Uh, maybe we're gonna just go on top of one of the. These just gonna track the zombies and I don't have any like I'm running out of food. Alright, um Oh that scared me, I thought I was gonna fall. Okay, uh uh could I just Yeah, I could go up here. Um Okay, let's just can I not Am I am I sinking into this? I think I could actually go through the leaves. Yeah, I could actually go through, so that's not a good thing. Let's just uh, do this right here. All right, guys. So now we're out here. It seems like the actual days go by really quick. So, um, are you kidding me? Are those just regular wolves? Because they don't have the red eyes. But I wonder if uh, they get red eyes when they actually see us and. They try to attack us, but I think the other ones actually saw us from kind of far away. So there's another pheasant over there, or not an pheasant, but a pheasant, right? I think that's what it's called. Man, it'd be really cool if the wolves could, we could like tame them and then they could attack the zombies. But uh, yeah, I guess we're spending. Whoa, these guys should spawn there. So we got two, four, six, eight, we got ten, and then like two of them fell into the ravine. Um hopefully the these guys over here could attack them. Alright, we're getting some more, so. Okay, that's a little bit of some lag. Seems like we're getting quite a few zombies over here. Looks like a firefly or something. Alright, so I guess the wolves don't attack the zombies. So that's man like what's going on this should be normal okay we got foxes over there uh, 
oh man these these are gonna be rough so it's gonna be tough guys but uh that's uh our first basically couple nights here in the mod so let me know in the comment section below what you guys think it seems like i'm gonna spend the night up here and then uh, we'll wait to the daytime and just you know just run for it and i uh, try to find like a better place um and uh, just hurry up and set up a house or some look how many just spawned over there and what is that guy holding he's holding the shovel oh man we need to make like some sort of trap right in order for them to fall so that's probably going to be something a good idea to do on the next episode so stay tuned and let me know in the comment section below what you guys think but that's going to be it for this episode guys don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos and i guess i'll just catch you guys on the next one team rocket draws out